Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video tutorial, we are going to learn about starting a new activity in Flutter or going into a new activity or a new screen in Flutter, which also called which is also called routing or routes in Flutter. So first I will delete this test folder because I do not need this. Now I'll come to this uh, file, new, new project and here uh, I have uh, started a Android uh, project so I have to create a new Flutter project. Now from here I will select this Flutter application and click next and now here I will uh, route uh, and click next and uh, here I will click finish now it will take some time to create this project um, until then if you have not subscribed my channel please subscribe my channel because I need your love and support for this channel now the project is created and we have this uh, default code in it so I'll remove this as well as I will remove this now in run app App method I will call material material app and I'll put semicolon here and now here it has uh, some properties and uh, the first one is title and here I will use uh, a route and uh, the second one is uh, home and in home I will call my app class and uh, we have not created this my app class so I will uh, so I create it here class my app extends uh, now the stateless widget we will extend a stateless widget and now curly braces now I'll click on this and I'll create missing override now here I will create my view so it will return the return type of this build method is a widget so I will return scape fold and now here I have uh, some properties so the first one is a bar and a bar and here uh, in a bar we have a title property and I, I will give it text and I will give the uh, name is first screen and now there is another property in a uh, scaffold which is body and here I will use the center widget widget and in center widget uh, I will create a raised uh, as a, 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 and we have to use child property of this uh, center widget and I will use raise button and um, this button I will use the child text and on text I will uh, give the text go to second screen and uh, I will give it a color colors dot blue and then I will mm, show on press property and here I will write the code for going to a new uh, route now I will uh, I are a new screen I will come to this lab lab and I will create a new dot file and I will name it um, second screen and enter 
now I will create a class second extends stateless widget and now I'll click on this and create missing overrides now here I will create the screen for the second widget now here I forgot the curly braces so I'll use the curly brace here and as well as down here now here the return type of this build method is widget so I'll return material app widget and now here I will use title and for title I will use uh, route and then I will uh, 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 read, uh, another property of this uh, material app home and in home I will use scaffold call the scaffold widget and here I will put semicolon and now in scaffold I have a bar property and I will use app bar and for app bar I will use uh, uh, title and for title I will use text and here the text will be um, a second screen and now I will use body and in body I will use center widget and in center widget I will create um, a child called raise button and uh, in raise button I have a child and in this child I will use text and uh, I will use go back and uh, the color of this raise button will be colors dot blue and on pressed I will use and the code I will use to go back is uh, navigator dot pop and it will use a context and now I will go to first screen and here I will use the code navigator inside this curly braces navigator dot push and here in the route I will use material page route this one and here we have uh, a builder and in builder I will use context and then the name of the uh, second screen and now put semicolon here now we have coded the app so let's run it and uh, let's check it now the app is running on the device so let's check it if I click on this go to second screen you can see it uh, come to the second screen you can see it on this uh, a bar here second screen now if I click this go back it uh, pop up to the first screen uh, again and uh, uh, that's all for today I hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you